de la Valle vacuum pump, pump oil, uh, what I'm doing here is to compare it with a regular oil that we know farmers are using. Um, I put two samples into hot water and uh, out of the freezer I take two samples that has been really, really cold. If we turn them upside down, we see that one is still very, very thick and stick uh, to, the, to the bottom of the flask. Oil is very, it varies dependent on temperature of uh, the surrounding. This is a sample of what the oil is looking like when it's 20 degrees. Uh, the temperature and the lubrication of oil is really have a very strong link. Uh, this oil is, this flask is uh, prepared, so the oil is acting as it is minus five degrees, but it's still in room temperature. This flask is how the oil is acting when it's plus 70 degrees. We know that the vacuum pump as such is has it need a very, very wide range of working temperature from below degrees, uh, zero degrees up to more than 100. The oil we have is developed together with the pump uh, in order to really meet the demands uh, the oil can, or the pump has on the oil. Uh, when we compare the Delaval vacuum pump oil with the regular engine oil or uh, machine oil that we know farmers sometimes are using, we can see that this oil is not even as good fluidy uh, as the Delaval oil with five degrees minus in room temperature. And if we then compare it when it's getting hot, yes, that also gets more uh, fluid but the ones we took out of the freezer, that is still really, really stiff. What is then the impact, or what impact has by using this oil on the pump? Well, the pump will not get lubricated, meaning it will wear uh, out far, far earlier than it could be, uh, or it, it's actually designed to last if you are using the right oil.